now for Eyewitness News. Call 12 for action. Well, selfies are all the rage on social media, but would you ever think that a selfie could help land you a job? No, I didn't think that. Snapping a photo or recording a video could become part of your sales pitch to a potential employer. Consumer Report and Susan Hogan has uh, those details for us now. Experts say the job search is evolving and now job seekers are connecting with potential employers in a variety of innovative ways. For Max Walker, getting an interview for an internship at an advertising agency was as easy as sending a snap. I found that they were doing this Snapchat campaign and I just caught my eye. It was a creative way to express myself and apply to a position. And having applicants express themselves is exactly what Sherry Ann Green was looking for when she set up the campaign to recruit interns. Snapchat really gave us an impression of people's personalities and how they would engage with social media really early in the recruitment process. Today, applicants are going beyond the typical written resume and cover letter. Mark Newman is the founder of HireView, a platform that lets companies have applicants complete recorded video interviews. No one can say my resume re represents who I am. So that's when it comes into video and other cool tools that empower people to tell their story. Alyssa O'Brien for the Society of Human Resource Management says these new recruiting tools are good for companies too. In order for you to get noticed and see, be seen as an innovator, you have to embrace the technology that is really out there. As for Max, his internship turned into a full-time job. I would say this is a more personal way to connect with less pressure. You're not a statistic. You're more of a, you know, a human voice and personality. If you're thinking of turning to one of these routes to get noticed, Mark Newman of Higher View says, be sure to be yourself. Tell your story and demonstrate your ability to work. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228-1850. I'm Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.